up YouTube? What's poppin'? It's your girl Angel Sky and I'm coming at you with another banger video. And on today's video, as you can see by the title, I'm going to be telling you what I wish I knew before I got braces. And also tips that helped me after I had braces. So, if you want to see, just continue to watch this video. We're going to jump right into it. Number one. So, number one is your teeth are going to hurt. They're going to hurt. I didn't believe everybody when they said, oh, when they first put it on your teeth, they're going to hurt. Because they didn't start hurting immediately for me. Um, it took a good six hours before my teeth actually started to hurt really bad. Excuse me. And it was so bad that I could not eat anything so make sure you get you some soft foods like yogurt applesauce you know maybe noodles because it's gonna be really difficult to eat number two so when i initially got braces i only saw people with power chains you will not start off with power chains if you don't know what power chains are and rubber bands these are rubber bands that are single ties and the power chains are the ones that go all the way across. I'm going to insert pictures if I can. Yeah, that power chains is the ones that everybody else wants. But these are kind of like when you're still in your first phase. Cannot wait to get into power chains because they are totally cute. So yeah, let's go ahead and jump right into number three. So you guys, it is going to be extremely important to floss when you have braces. Like, it's important to floss anyway, but with braces, it's even more important because you don't want to get cavities. And I don't know, for some reason, it's just easier for a food to get stuck in between your teeth. So, if you don't want your breath to smell, get these, um, these little flossers that are for, specifically for braces. It literally takes me five seconds to floss all my teeth. Not five seconds, literally. But it's quicker than the ones where, like, you got to put it through the braces and, like, with the string. It's, it's tedious. Nobody wants to have to do that. So, go ahead and get those. They've been extremely helpful in making sure that I do not get any cavities because you don't want cavities. Let's go ahead and get into tip number four. So, getting braces takes... A lot of getting used to when I first got my braces I talked with a lisp and it was just like really hard to like feel like how I wanted my mouth to adjust so yeah that's normal if you talk with a lisp you'll, you'll be talking regular within a few weeks no worries let's get into tip number that five maybe I don't know let's just continue with the video so I'm gonna tell you guys, it is extremely easy for your breath to smell with braces because there are things getting stuck in the brackets and the crevices and all these things. Make sure you floss. Make sure you're brushing your teeth really well. Invest in an electric toothbrush, please. Water picks. The Amazon flossers that I have in the description box below. Because my brother, when I was about to get braces, he said, please don't get braces. Please don't get braces. I said, why? And he said, every single girl that I have ever dated who had braces, her breast smelled terrible. He said he never met a girl and her breath did not stink with braces. Stay on top of that because nobody wants to be known for having smelly breath just because we want our t-shirt. So, yeah. I guess that could go ahead and be tip number five because, yeah. Do you guys want to hear a bathroom joke? <laughs> you trying to kill us? Oh, oh, so, this is tip number six, I believe. So, the color of your the little ties, they actually matter. So, according to orthodontists, the darker colors tend to have be stronger. So if you want to get out of braces quicker, you might want to go for darker colors like black 
navy blue and things of that sort because who, who doesn't want to be out of braces faster and also the darker colors also contrast the color of your teeth so your teeth will look extremely white when you use those darker colors so colors like pink or red they are going to be not as strong as black or navy blue and things like that so let's get right into the next tip let's go ahead and get into tip number seven tip number seven if you go to the dentist no if you go to the orthodontist every month or you know sometimes some of our appointments are every three months like my appointments are every three months i always get black because it does not change colors i started off getting pink and by a few weeks of eating things that stain them they would be yellow you don't want yellow yellow ties in your mouth for three months it's not cute it makes your teeth look yellow so that is another reason why to get dark colors because you don't want them turning yellow in your mouth they change colors so quick the lighter colors so yeah let's get into tip number eight again you may not go to the dentist every month or every three months like it really just depends on your treatment I thought like dang why are my appointments so spaced out as opposed to somebody who's who goes every month to get you know their braces tightened so your time might vary from one of the friends who wears braces than you do so that's typical don't think anything of it don't get mad your orthodontist knows what they're doing so let's go ahead and get into tip number nine y'all this is something that I had no idea that happens. Getting braces will create more gaps. So I initially got braces because I wanted to close these two gaps. And it ended up making the gaps wider. Yes. And I'm just like, dang, I got braces to fix it. And it it has not fixed the gaps yet it's only made them worse but sometimes it gets worse before it gets better trust your orthodontist they know what they're doing because i started off i really didn't need braces i really just wanted my teeth to be perfect because of the few spaces that i did have so if you have more crooked teeth you probably might see improvement you know and not any spaces or any extra problem that the braces may be. Number 10, also, if you don't have like really bad teeth, you may not see improvement. Like I've had braces for a year, December, January. Yeah, I've had my braces for exactly a year and like a week or two. And I really don't see much change in my teeth. The only changes that I see is like these teeth, this teeth, no, this tooth is like more in place. And, but as opposed to the top, I don't really see a huge difference because all I wanted was those spaces closed. I do see like my smile is like much more like wider, I guess you could say, uh, which is really cute. And I can't wait to get them off because they're gonna look so good, but I hardly see any difference. So yeah. You might see a difference really fast, or you may not. But trust your orthodontist, as they say. Let's get into tip number 11. Okay, so this may just be for me, or it may be for you as well. Um, if you currently have braces and you're watching this video, drop in the comments below if you feel the same as I do. But I learned to start eating differently so for instance when i go to chipotle i don't get beans because i don't like how mushy they get and mix in my brackets like it's just disgusting to me so yeah i change the way i eat and also when i'm at restaurants you know i eat with my back teeth i make sure not to eat with my front teeth because i don't want like weird foods getting stuck in my teeth and then people being able to see it so yeah, you will learn to eat a certain way in public so that people will not see, you know, 
all in your mouth and you don't want stuff all in your teeth which leads me to number 12. this is just like a really good tip when you're out um you want to drink water more than anything else because like let's say you're at a restaurant and you drink some water you just swish it around in your mouth like try to get any debris out of your teeth so when you smile you won't have that piece of lettuce sticking right in your front two teeth tip number 13 let's go your mouth is going to get cut up especially like within the first few months of you having braces um like my jaw used to always get caught like and it it, it would just be terrible it would just be terrible but your orthodontist should give you orthodontics wax and they also have the little things that you can put in that are like teeth guards for when you sleep so that it won't cut up your cheeks um i no longer use orthodontist wax starting from the beginning it was really annoying but my mouth ended up toughening up which yours will too to prevent the cuts and things like that so yeah i rarely get cuts anymore except for like right now like it kind of hurts up top but i just ignore it and my mouth just is getting is just used to it at this point getting cuts but it does get better when you do get used to it like i did all right let's get into tip number 14. okay so this step is really dependent upon you uh, most orthodontists will tell you do not use whitening toothpaste because like it'll whiten the teeth around but not the teeth that are under the brackets so you'll end up having like different color spots on your teeth once it's time to get your braces off uh, however I was doing that in the beginning but now I'm starting to use whitening toothpaste after a year because I do drink like red wine I might go to Starbucks and get me you know some coffee or whatever so i noticed that my teeth weren't as white as they usually are so i started using whitening toothpaste but after i get through with this whole tube of whitening toothpaste i'm gonna go back to just cavity protection toothpaste with no whitener so yeah and i'm just gonna like alternate so that way hopefully my teeth don't look yellow but they also don't cause spots on my teeth so yeah let's go ahead and get into step number 15 we just gonna keep them coming so this is strictly for aesthetic purposes if you are a girl you're going to want to keep your lip gloss on deck keep your lip gloss on deck because i don't know braces make your lips really dry really dry and they also the lip gloss makes your lips pop it makes your lips pop like yeah and if you're a guy make sure you keep that chapstick on deck because you're going to definitely need it number 16 your lips are going to appear a, to be slightly bigger because your your like mouth is like pursed out a little bit um so yeah you'll probably like that because i know i do personally at first i didn't know how i would feel about my lips being bigger i didn't know if i would look like myself or whatever the case may be but people actually did notice that my lips were bigger like i'll be on facetime with people and they'll be like oh did you, your lips got bigger because of the braces and i was like it's possible so yep your lips will appear to be slightly bigger which is kind of a good thing you know get a little free well, not free because these braces are expensive, which you know, Kylie, Kylie did a lip kit or whatever. So, yeah, let's get into number 17. Number 17, your teeth will feel loose. So, like, when I, like, shake my teeth, they kind of got, I was kind of scared. I'm like, oh, my God, my teeth are going to fall out. But that's completely normal for your teeth to feel a little bit loose because the roots are moving and all these things like that. So, yeah, don't be afraid of that. But number 18 is kind of similar to 17, uh, dealing with like how your teeth are gonna be. Like sometimes you'll like clutch down or like just randomly your teeth will start to like click. 
And I was a little bit scared because I'm like, why are my teeth clicking? Like, are my teeth gonna fall out once again? But your teeth will not fall out. Uh, that's completely normal. And a lot of people have that happen to them because like, I guess your teeth are moving and whoops or whatever. So let's get into number 19. All right, so this one is sometimes difficult to determine whether you should or shouldn't do. So, so I know some orthodontists tell people don't use, well, don't chew gum. However, I found that chewing gum sometimes helps get debris out of your teeth. You just have to chew sugar-free gum and be careful that it doesn't like get stuck in your brackets or, and if it does get stuck in your brackets, just clean it really well. And, you know, like make sure there's no gum in your brackets. So yeah, and I also talked to a lot of other people who had braces before me and they also told me that chewing gum was like really good for making sure that one, your breath doesn't smell because all the food particles are in there. And two, to help get some of those food particles out of your teeth. So I think we're going on to number 20. So let's go ahead and get to number 20. Okay, so um, after like my first three orthodontist appointments, my teeth stopped hurting when I got them tightened as much. So like the first few tightenings, it was like really almost unbearable um, how badly like I could not eat. But I just got my braces tightened like a week ago. And like the pain was like, was barely there, honestly. Like it hurt a little bit, but I guess my mouth is so used to like all the shifting, it has adapted to that. So, you know, keep your head up. It's not gonna hurt all the time. But once you go from these to power chains, it probably will hurt. And if you get rubber bands and as they start to do it, it might start to hurt more, but I haven't reached there yet. So yeah, you know, drop it down in the comments and let us know if that is just as painful or like if it's not as bad, you know, just give us advice down in the comments for when we do get power chains and organs. What's nine plus 10? I have never, knock on wood, <laughs> broken a bracket. I, I literally eat anything I want. I eat caramel, I eat popcorn, I eat Takis. And I have yet to break a bracket. So, I mean, you can listen to your orthodontist, but I'm gonna just tell you, there's a lot of people out there who have not broken a bracket. Drop down in the comments below if you have ever broken a bracket and what, what were you eating when you broke the bracket because I need to stay away from that. Number 22, 23, don't know, don't care. Um, so yeah, when you first get your braces, people are going to notice them. No matter how much you try, to make them not notice it, they're gonna notice it. Everybody's gonna be like, oh my gosh, you got braces. Oh my gosh, when you get braces? All in your face, like, oh my gosh, when you get braces? <laughs> so yeah, don't take it personal. Um, yeah, just be confident. When I initially got braces, I was not as confident in my smile anymore. Like, I feel like I look like a bad kid, cause you know, I'm kinda grown. Like, I'm a little grown, I got braces, like it's childish for me, but I'm still a little self-conscious about it, but yeah, let's get into the next one, 23, 2023. So yeah, number 23. You might not like how you look in braces, but braces, having braces is trending. Guys love braces. Didn't I know that? I was actually worried about getting braces because the guy that I was dating at the time, I was like, oh my gosh, well, he doesn't like me anymore. Well, what if he doesn't think they're cute? Like, nah, because to me, braces are not cute. Now they are, now that I have them and I've gotten used to them. Like, I feel like they add a little a razzle dazzle to my face, you know, like it's like a little face jewelry or whatever. So, yeah, I do. People do find braces attractive. So, do with that what you will. But, yeah, y'all. With your braces, just be confident. You're gonna get used to them. Don't sweat it. You got this. Because after you get your braces off, you're gonna have a beautiful, beautiful smile. Make sure you guys drop down in the comments as well any tips that you may have or things you wish you knew before getting braces to help anybody else who might be watching this video. All right, you guys, that is the end of this video. If you like this video, make sure you go ahead and leave me a like Get those fingers moving in the comments 
and don't forget to subscribe to your girl because why wouldn't you kisses and i will see you guys in another video peace Oh, 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 oh,